Welcome to the weekly session of our Evolution and Behavior podcast. In the next three minutes, I will tell you about conflicts in animal families. Ever since there have been families, there have been conflicts. Ever wondered why your parents argue? In an animal family, each individual defends its own interests to pass on its genes to the next generation. In many animals, including the giant Australian cuttlefish, a female would benefit from having multiple partners, making her kids more diverse. On the other hand, males will jealously guard their partner to avoid being cheated on. Sneaky bastard. This behavior is called mate guarding. Parents are not the only ones to be involved. Siblings often fight for their parents' attention or for resources. In blue-footed boobies, for example, two to three chicks need to share the fish that their parents bring them. But why share in times of need? When you could have it all for yourself. This extreme outcome is called a siblicide. Taking care of your offspring is a relentless business. Children will suck the energy out of you. Therefore, parents must make sure they invest their energy in their most promising offspring. When times are hard and food is scarce, many animals find extreme solutions to avoid the cost of care. The wild rabbit, for example, is more violent than its cute little face would let you think. What this adorable mother just did is called filial cannibalism. Gruesome. But humans can do better. Or can they? No idea what they sound like. <laughs> the angry male squid sound. <laughs> the sexy female squid sound. <laughs> the munching rabbit sound. <laughs> Ha <laughs> 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 <laughs>